Hi, I'm Matt from Music Makers, and I'm here today to tell you a little bit about our Dakota Mandola. Um, I have one right here. This is the Mandola, and I have it sitting right next to our Dakota Mandolin. They look very similar, uh, so I'm just going to briefly tell you how the Mandola is different and what's different about it. Um, the, the main thing that's different about it is the tuning. Uh, this is tuned and pitched lower than the mandolin. So one way to think about this is um, a mandolin is tuned like a violin. So it's tuned G, D, A, E. And the mandola is tuned like a viola. So it's tuned C, G, D, A. Uh, the way that works out musically, it's tuned a fifth lower than a mandolin. And another way to demonstrate that is if you're playing this chord on a mandolin, you're playing a G chord. Now I can take that exact same chord shape on a mandola, but now I'm playing a C chord, which is a fifth lower than a mandolin. So that's how these are different, and the, the reason for that is the scale length. The mandola has a 17 inch scale length. The distance between the nut and the bridge is 17 inches on the mandola. On the mandolin, it's 14 inches. Um, like all of our instruments, our mandola here is available as a kit that you can build yourself. Uh, it's a pretty straightforward kit. If you really would like to explore that option, I would highly recommend you download our kit assembly instructions and you can walk through the entire process and really find out if, if building a, uh, an instrument like this is for you. If you just want to get your hands on one and play, um, we do finish them here and we're happy to sell them finished. Some of the features on our mandola, um, we have a solid spruce soundboard, uh, we have rosewood fingerboard and bridge, we have some, on this particular instrument we have some optional inlay, uh, you can add this to your kit or finished instrument as uh, a decoration and an option. We also sell a router bit set that will help you route in the groove to install this inlay. It's, it's really not that hard. Uh, we have solid mahogany sides. Here, these little pieces here are corner blocks and they're made out of uh, our walnut. And this is how this kit goes together. The solid mahogany back and a mahogany neck and you can see we use the gold uh, inline tuners and we have a, a bone nut and there's some side marker dots as well and a gold tail piece um, it's a real quality instrument it's got some uh, some nice quality wood uh, and great hardware and it's fun to play. It adds a nice texture to your ensemble if you want something a little bit different uh, than the mandolin but plays a lot like a mandolin. Uh, so it's a lot of fun to play. So why don't we listen to one being played? I've asked Jake to demonstrate the mandola for you um, so you can hear what it sounds like. Jake's the luthier that designed the instrument and is also uh, an excellent picker. So I'm going to back him up here on Shady Grove. And here we go.